2 part 2 uh, okay so what we did is we went to windows phone internals we unlocked the bootloader then he told us the windows phone internal screen told us to reboot the phone we rebooted the phone and it completed the unlocked uh, bootloader process now after that automatically the phone went to the windows phone operating system yes so as you see then we we need to remove the cable here uh, then power off the phone then power on the phone this is very important step power off the phone power on the phone just try opening some apps here and uh, just uh, just do this that and go to settings uh, system this is very important you know the phone uh, write some information in the this one so in uh, like first boot complete step kind of so this is very important step so this done now now what we do is if you see my screen uh, now first go to now just if you want to reboot the computer also then don't connect the phone as of now open windows phone internal tool here then then you connect the phone now okay now you connect the phone okay so this is done now close this window the phone is recognized here then go to manual mode click switch to mass storage mode then your phone goes to choices goodbye and it just goes to the mass storage mode it will it will reboot for two three times then it will go to the mass storage mode so let's just wait So as you can see here, the, when it, the phone boots for third time, the Microsoft logo comes up and now this is the important thing. Uh, the your USB sound and this Microsoft logo should go off. For most people what happens is this is the place where they face issues and it uh, boots to, it goes to that windows gear screen. So that is the issue, uh, issue screen. It's like uh, there's some pro there was some problem in unlocking the phone. That is why I, I tell every time that uh, using Windows to, uh, recovery tool uh, after uh, setting up the phone properly shut down and uh, restart after also Windows phone in, then you unlock the boot loader with this, uh, using uh, Windows phone internal tool you probably shut down and restart the phone okay now we are in MSM mode and uh, you know this folder comes up these are related to the phone so don't touch as of now nothing let me just explain you this so now we are in most storage mode and this windows phone to show this minimize this window let it be there close this now first thing is go to your uh, hard disk manager okay click enter now as you can see see this is my uh, disk one which is my uh, SD card portion this is okay wait I think it's gonna be a little clear okay data so you see a data with a file size of 26.11 here you need to shrink your volume click shrink right click shrink okay then uh, it will ask you amount to shrink uh, enter the amount of uh, uh, enter the amount to shrink your data if you are able to see it, I am gonna just go near it. Uh, what's the noise? My okay, just a minute. Yeah. If you see here, it says enter the amount of space to shrink in MB. We put 18,000, and if you say total size after shrink in MB, this says 8739. Actually, if, uh, what we are doing here is uh, as you know your phone has a big uh, 32 GB uh, space in that uh, we want at least 18 GB for uh, the windows operating system we are just keeping there and 8.7 GB for the phone uh, other uh, operating system so we are just okay sorry, uh, sorry, my, sorry for that okay now we just click shrink here okay. now if you see here you have an unallocated data of uh, 17.5 GB here. See this is the 17.5 GB here. 
so we are ready with the first step first step is we are making sure we we, we are creating a storage space for the windows 10 operating system in the phone don't touch other partitions please never touch other partitions uh, if you there are a lot of partitions of windows phone i really rec i don't recommend you touching any any other partition be careful while you shrink please notice and shrink what we did is we went to the data we shrink the that part of the data to 18 gb here so unallocated comes to 18 gb okay so main important this is a lot of partition if you mess up with the partition the phone will not phone will go to the boot loop in the sense it will get bricked you can recover it but uh, there are minimal chances for that okay now close the windows recovery recovery tool now you want something called as uh, departed tool so next uh, now uh, so first step was the uh, flashing windows uh, phone via windows device recovery tool then we uh, used windows phone internals to unlock the bootloader now we have uh, went, went to the third step of uh, creating a space for the windows uh, 10 operating system in the phone okay so that is that uh, which we went to the artist partition manager we uh, there we have uh, unallocated space there about 18 gb for windows 10 now the third step uh, please go to the third step video thanks